Breaking news now from Milwaukee's east side. Police have arrested the man. They say murdered a cook inside the George Webb restaurant near Oakland and Locust. And the cook was coming to the rescue of a waitress when he was shot. The murder has shaken the east side. Shannon Sims is live at the scene with the latest. Shannon. Well, Mike and Courtney, this new development that the gunman has now been in custody as both customers and employees relieve tonight. Ralston Shanklin is still in disbelief to learn that the young cook he often spoke to at this George Webb diner was gunned down. My heart goes out to his family. Early this morning after bar closed, police say a group got rowdy inside the Eastside Diner, throwing things around. A waitress asked them to leave. A struggle began, and that's when the cook stepped in to help, a decision that cost him his life. One of those individuals, a career criminal and convicted felon, returned with a handgun and shot the 21-year-old cook in the chest. Surveillance cameras inside and outside of the restaurant captured the suspect's face. Late this evening, investigators arrested the man in a home on the north side. Shanklin says if the weather wasn't so bad this morning, he would have been in the restaurant eating breakfast at the time of the shooting. Whenever time I walk past here, I'm just going to see him cooking. The cook, Reginald Evans, just 21 years old. The cold-blooded murder has the mayor outraged. This was a young man, no criminal record, working in a George Webb's, doing the right thing. I have a 21-year-old son, uh, and I can't imagine what the family of this 21-year-old young man is going through right now. The George Webb here on Oakland Avenue remains closed tonight. Now, we have learned that the man in custody is 28 years old and a convicted felon. Reporting on the east side, Jed and Sims, today's TMJ4. Okay.